Alright guys, I am back. You know, it started with the acid reds. Then it went to the acid blues. And now, I have the last of them. Once again, three pack of acid green cigarette. Alright, and it says it's untamed, so obviously it's just to get attention, but let's go ahead and give us a sniffer. Now this is an acid, you know, crap, they're all stuck at the bottom, come on, Did you look at, whoa, look at that, if I'm correct, that's lighter than the other two, look at that shit. I don't know. I, I honestly forget what, you know, but I remember the flavor, so that's all that counts. All right. Whoa. Okay. <sighs> hmm. Okay, guys. This is unique. It took a long time for my for it to light because the fact that my dumbass you know, it was me. It was my fault. But this, this is beautiful. Of all of them, I think this is my favorite because this one has a kind of a creaminess to it. All right. Oh yeah. This has a lot of creaminess to it. All right. Now I'm no cigar aficionado. I'm literally, you know, I am. I'm a. I'm pretty much a cigarette only kind of person, with the occasional cigarillo. All right. You know, I normally have two or three cigarillos a month. All right. people oh yeah this is good all right you know this has a sweetness to it on the leaf itself all right it has a sweetness to it. It's creamy. It has a little bit of like a uh, has 
has like a little bit of a woody, you know, a little, it tastes a little bit like wood, alright? Um, you know, it has that, it has the woody, you know, flavor to it. Um, I know it's a little, I know a little bit about cigar terms because, you know, me and I, I know somebody who's an avid, you know, cigar so, smoker, so he always has like 13 cigars in his, you know, in his room, you know, he has five in his car at all times, so yes, to say that he's an avid cigar smoker, yeah, <laughs> <coughs> Okay, so this has a you know this is all around a well crafted cigarillo, you know well done acid, well done. This is one of the best, all right. Of course, that's in my opinion. You got the you know you know and don't get me wrong. This is a little bit you know for you know gas station cigarillos. This is a little bit more on the expensive side. But well, then again, look at what you know is the cheapest. Black and Miles. <coughs> oh. <sighs> now this is a well-crafted cigarillo. Alright, once again. I didn't inhale, actually. I should have coughed you know, I could feel a cough coming. It was just a bad timing. So, my throat, so right now my throat is, a, you know, is burning a little bit. So, back to this. This is one of my favorites. Alright. It's not my favorite at this period of time. Alright. This is a well crafted cigarillo, well thought out. I thought the blues were good. I thought the reds were good. They both hail in comparison to this. All right. Once again, where's that package at? All right. It says smooth, sweet, and aromatic. Check, check, and check. Okay. Okay, here we are. It says here on the back. The acid smoking experience is like no other. The acid untamed green cigarillo is encased in a vibrant candela wrapper. Inviting you to explore a luxurious world of quality tobaccos and stinked aromas. The experience of the finest candela tobacco in the world is your destination. We are awaiting your arrival at our special place. Well, God damn it, boys, this is good. All right, you know when they and this is a you know this is good quality right here. All right, this is not like this is not like a black and mild. This is not you know as much as I you know as much as they are awesome, they are not like a black stone. They are definitely no Cheyenne. This is a re you know this is beautiful. The fact that they said wrapper tells me that this is a pure that this is tobacco leaf. All right, I thought and I thought, but now I you know now it's confirmed that is wrapped in tobacco leaf. All right, because wrappers are normally tobacco you know wrappers um uh, it's what holds all the tobacco together in a cigar, and for this case the cigarillo which. It's beautiful, top notch. All right, this is quite literally what you know. I don't normally say a cigar, a cigar, or a cigarillo tastes good. This one has the combination of just 
beautiful. Very good. All right. Now, the hard part about this is the fact that I, you know, after this, I'm pro I want to have the other two, but I'm not because that would be a waste of tobacco if I just have all three in one day. You know, I've got a pack. You know, I've got a pack of cigarettes to go through. You know, I've got cigarettes. You know, and I'll probably be having a few cigarettes throughout the day. But this. Oh yeah. All right. You won't taste if you get this. You won't taste. <clears throat> the aftertaste is of almost pure tobacco. You know, pure cigar tobacco. Actually, take that back. It tastes a little bit like the Talons, which I need to get another pack of. Talon cigar, you know, cigars. Oh, those fuckers. Those fucking things. Oh. Goodness. Oh, yeah. This is an all around well crafted cigarette. Well done, Astrid. And well, and well done. Where's that package at? I think it's Drew Estates. I think it is. Just to make sure I want it. And welcome, and well done. Why did I say welcome? Well done, Drew Estate. Well done, Acid. Well done. All right. This right here. Get it now. Okay, this is all around one of the best cigarillos I've ever had in my life. The reason I, you know, I had to pitch because, well, I'm not in the mood to relight that. All right, and another thing is when you relight, you know, cigarillos, you know, they tend to lose everything that holds them good. So, yeah. But all around. All over. Hell yeah. Alright. Once again, it is the Acid Untamed Green. Smooth, sweet, and aromatic. The finest quality cigars. You are damn right. So, I'm going to save those for later on throughout the month. Hell yeah. Probably have them. Um, Probably throughout. Probably have one at Thanksgiving. And I'll save one for Christmas. That's what the fuck I'm gonna do. Alright. I got this. I got that last night, and god damn it. For those who don't know where I got this, it is in the TikTok at Bessemer. Well, not in Bessemer. I'm, uh, that's candy shit. In uh, Mount, Mount Jackson. The TikTok in Mount Jackson. You are very damn right. You are damn right, boy. Alright. So, this is all around, you know, all around. Well done. I mean, this is, that is one well-crafted cigarillo. It's creamy. It has a little bit of a wood undertone of, you know, the subtlety of tobacco. And, and if you lick your lips right after there's a sweet, you know, a taste, it has a sweet flavoring that I cannot, you know, it's just delicious. That is one of the most well crafted, that is one of the well, da 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 <laughs> That is one of the most well crafted cigarillos I've ever seen. So if you are into, <coughs> so if you are into cigarillos, alright, or if you want to try them, 
go ahead and get yourself a pack of acid blondes. You know, the acids. Acid blondes a cigar, but that's besides the point. All right. Go ahead and get yourself an acid cigarillo. All right. You know, I recommend the green. You know, obviously, because that just. I've never had a, I've never had the you know the the green ones up until today, and I'm happy as all hell I did. That is delicious. All right. Um, after that, I'm gonna have to go with the uh, the reds, and then I think I'll go with the blues. All right, but you know it's, it's all up to you. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. All right, guys. So once again, you know. Just well done. That's all I have to say. I'll see you all later. Bye.